In this video, we'll demonstrate how to stream your PS5 screen on Discord. But before we dive in, I'd like to invite you to hit that like button if you're excited to learn about streaming your PS5 on Discord and share your thoughts in the comments below. Your feedback helps us create better content for you. Let's get straight to the tutorial steps. The first thing you'll need is a computer for this process. Open a web browser and search for PS5 Remote Play. Tap on the official PS Remote Play link at the top. Using PS Remote Play, we can stream the PS5 screen onto a PC and then stream it on Discord. Scroll down to find the download section. Choose the Windows PC or Mac download as per your system. Download and install the app following the usual installation process. After installation, open the PS Remote Play app. Sign in with your PSN account ensuring it's the same account used on your PS5. Choose Preferred Data Settings, which won't affect the tutorial. Select your device. Follow the on-screen instructions to set up Remote Play. On your PS5, navigate to Settings, System, Remote Play. Ensure it's toggled on. If it's grayed out, set your PS5 as the primary console by going to Users and Accounts, Other Console Sharing, and enable it. Return to Remote Play on your computer. Click OK and wait for the connection to establish. Once connected, you can use the controls at the bottom of Remote Play or connect your controller to your PC or PS5 for normal gameplay. Now open Discord and start a voice call or enter a server. Click on Share Your Screen at the bottom left. Choose the screen you want to share, such as PS Remote Play. Hit Go Live and voila! You're now streaming your PlayStation screen on Discord. You can navigate, open games like Fortnite, and share your gameplay seamlessly. If you found this tutorial helpful, please take a moment to like, comment, and subscribe with notifications on. Your support encourages us to create more content like this. For additional tech tutorials and gaming tips, visit MediaMagnetGuide.com.